Anyone can become unable to maintain human connections due to illness or disability. A society in which no one feels isolated, whatever their level of physical ability. Placing importance on inclusivity, Japan is making various efforts to make this vision a reality. In this cafe in Tokyo, customers are served by robots called Orihime. This robot is operated remotely by a pilot, a person who has difficulty going outside. The pilots are people whose situations once prevented them from taking part in certain activities. This experimental cafe lets them meet people and build relationships. People homebound with ALS talk about difficulty meeting people and discovering new things. I started this research thinking about my own future and felt we needed to find ways for people to work and engage in society so that they don't face the problem of isolation. Nene encountered Orihime as a high school student and piloted an avatar robot. Now she's in university, hoping to become a social worker. While working as a pilot, Masa is developing an Orihime robot that can cook for kids with similar disabilities. With Orihime robots, we don't just want to give people jobs as avatar pilots, but to work together with them to create a future in which even homebound people can participate in society. The number of such people is gradually growing. Even people who've lost mobility can lead vibrant lives and stay connected to the world around them. With the power of technology, Japan is creating a more inclusive society.